Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Recently, Microsoft rolled out the first Moment One update for Windows 11 version 22H2, as I have been posting on. And one of the improvements that they brought with that first wave of new features was the Amazon App Store Android app support becoming available now in 31 new countries. Now, unfortunately, um, I'm not in any of those new regions and new countries with the um, Amazon App Store Android app support. But nonetheless, um, as I posted on last week, uh, Microsoft had released an update for the WSA, the Windows subsystem for Android, which, as many of you would know, is needed to run Android apps on Windows 11. And that was to insiders in the dev and beta channels that brought changes that improved security, camera, general reliability and performance. Now, I'll leave a link in the description to that video if that would be of interest. But just to do a follow on um, from that video, as um, it seems that Microsoft is going to be bringing quite a big update to the WSA, the Windows subsystem for Android in the uh, future. And according to an updated roadmap published by Microsoft on GitHub, uh, it seems that um, according to this roadmap, Microsoft is going to be upgrading the WSA, the Windows subsystem for Android, to Android 13. And um, if we just take a quick look at the roadmap, here's a snippet of what's currently available, they say. That's in the green with the tick. So those are the features that are available currently in WSA. Features unavailable with the red X and what they have on their radar for the future, basically in the blue square. Now, if we just head over to a better image um, for the purpose of this video, um, just so we can take a better look if you are interested. Um, as mentioned, current features, available and unavailable, and yes, the future roadmap. So upgrading the Windows subsystem to uh, Windows subsystem for Android to Android 13 is on their radar for the future. And um, we don't know exactly what's going to be new in Android 13 uh, for Windows uh, 11's WSA integration. But at this stage, um, as we can see from the future roadmap, uh, it's going to roll out, it could roll out with uh, a new file transfer feature that will basically allow you to transfer files between the WSA and uh, the Windows operating system, uh, shortcuts, and then uh, picture in picture, pip, the picture in picture mode, which will more or less allow you to run Android apps, um, as an example, on top of other Windows apps. And that's very similar to your picture in picture mode, as many of you would know, you get on YouTube as an example and when you activate picture in picture mode and then um, local network access by default could also be um, on their radar for the future when it comes to um, improvements made to the Windows subsystem for Android and um, in true Microsoft fashion though we don't know exactly when um, and if and when these um, new features will be made available for the WSA but according to reports um, we can expect them uh, possibly to roll out uh, early next year in 2023, but that hasn't been officially confirmed by Microsoft yet. But um, I will keep you updated um, as to any um, new developments. But just wanted to let you know that now it seems that Microsoft will be upgrading Windows subsystem for Android to Android 13 early next year. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.